to provide you with a design, a recommended design from the jail committee of the final jail design, uh, and then ask for you to approve a design and give permission to go to County Council at their December 11th meeting to provide the final fund funding on the project. Um, just as an overview, uh, if you would go down one slide for me. Um, we put together a jail committee, and I'll go a lot of great work on this. Keep going. There you go. Stay on mission. There you go. That's what I go back to. I'll talk about that in a minute. Mission. We, when we put that committee together, the first thing we did is we said, you know, this is this is a big project and we need to understand exactly where we're going and what we're trying to accomplish. Uh, make sure everybody's on the same page. We worked very hard, a couple of hours of time was spent really thinking about what we wanted to accomplish. So we created a mission for the committee. That mission then has been revisited at every meeting just to make sure we're holding true to what the committee was responsible for accomplishing for the county. That mission was to passionately design and build a quality, and that word is underlined, a quality jail with an okay, unquestionable return on investment, measured by flexibility, size, safety, programming, functionality. At completion, we will operate efficiently, maintain a safe and secure community, and position the county to respond to growth in an ever-changing corrections landscape. Um, and I, I just don't think we could say it better in terms of what was in front of us. Those are all the challenges within um, you know, some, some challenging financial uh, considerations as well. If you would go to the next slide. 